I'm happy to help with anything I can. If you say so. We get our drinking water from a purifier not far outside of town. We had a bad storm not long before you got here, and it must have damaged the fog condensers that protect the road to the purifier. I sent Howard Dunbar out to fix them. He was out there when the Mirelurks hit us, and I'm, I'm afraid they might have got him, too. I was hoping you might go have a look. If the worst happened, maybe you could get those fog condensers back online. If you're up to it, just head south out of town. It's paying work, of course. I wouldn't ask a stranger to stick their neck out on our behalf, unless I was willing to pay a fair share for it. Am I going to need any tools or parts if I have to make these repairs on my own? The fog condensers need their power modules replaced, but Howard took the only spares we had. Either way, you're going to have to find him first. All right, I'll head out there now. Good. Our water supply won't last much longer. Answers myself. Those fog condensers are back online.
Good. Our water supply was starting to get low. Wasn't sure how much longer we could hold out. Did you find Howard? He died trying to get those condensers fixed. The man is a hero. Yes. Yes, he is. I'll make sure we remember him as such. Well, I said it was paying work. 200 caps should be enough. Is there anything else I can do to help? Don't know if you've chatted up the Mariner, but she's always looking for help. I know Cassie Dalton was asking around, but... Uh, oh well, judge for yourself there. Thanks. Glad I can help you out. That makes two of us. Now here's your pay. Gotta start making arrangements for Howard. So I'll say goodbye. around on the house. That's awfully friendly of you. We have mainlanders coming in and out all the time. Worst of a lot are thieves or murderers. And the others we find floating face down in the harbor. But not you. Mitch, I mean, since he did the captain's dance, maybe your uncle? That's my own family business. Sir, Mitch is too damn proud. But we're worried about Uncle Ken. What's wrong with his uncle? Uncle Ken's the last one still living on the island. The last holdout. Crazier than a bag full of starved mole rats he is. Mitch sent him some of the fog condensers? So he might still be alive. He's safe from the fog. But the campground's got to be swarming with God knows what. Listen, it shames me to ask it. Oh, but he is my kin. Could you check up on him and find some way to drag his hide back here? I'll pay, of course. I'll look for your uncle. His homestead's the old visitor center, inland. Look out, he loves his traps.
corpses? They're from me. Unless you're ready for the long walk, go away! You killed them all? By yourself? What? Just because I'm an old man, you don't think I can protect myself? Wrong! Your nephew's worried about you. He sent me. Mitch? My boy Mitch sent you? He was always a smart one. He sent me the fog condensers. Made it safe to breathe here. Glad to hear he still cares about his old uncle. But you... What? What have you done? They're coming! They're coming! Then let's work together. Oh, fine. I haven't reset my traps or repaired the defenses. Quick, do what you can with the workbench supplies. They'll be here soon.
Um. Not bad. Mitch was a good boy to send you. But still, time to go. Goodbye. Goodbye. Before you attract more of them. Mitch sent me to bring you home. Safely. Please, go to Far Harbor. This is my home. And what? You want me to huddle like a beggar in Far Harbor? I... I can't just leave. Consider this a vacation. You'll come back later, when it's safe. You are so persistent. Fine. You happy? You've chased me from my home. Ah, I'll pack my things. Chase me from my home? We should dump him in the harbor. You're really not grateful? You get to see your boy again. Ah, it is good to see family again. He never visits or writes. Here. I... I... Mitch is at a loss for words. Hush now. I owe you one. Oh, long, He is a small child. He 